Hello everybody, Soda Hunter here. I am in Winnie, Texas, and I'm done for the evening. It's really late at night right now, but I have a full 10 hours before I can move again, so gotta have a little bit of time here. And before I eat dinner, uh, I'm going to uh, want to drink something that is one of my favorite sodas to go with it, and I wanted to share it with you. This is a Swamp Pop Noble Cane Cola. You can find these at World Market and Rouse's grocery stores. Um, that's kind of a Louisiana, Southern Alabama, Mississippi thing. Uh, there's not a lot of them outside of the Gulf Coast, I know that. But um, they have all the flavors at the different Rouse's and World Markets that I know of. Uh, the different flavors are Satsuma Fizz, Praline and Cream Soda, you have the Noble Cane, Cane Cola, and you have a Ginger Ale also. Uh, forgive me if I don't know the exact uh, wording of the flavor of the uh, Ginger Ale. It's got a weird name to it, and I have one ready in the waiting. I just don't have it right now with me, and I've never had it before. This is the only one I have had before, and you can check it out. It's neat looking, it really is. Uh, and you'll see already in the gl in the uh, glass there how it's frothed up. It's it's a very unique flavor of cola. When you get a cola, you expect something that tastes very similar to a Pepsi or a Coke, maybe uh, an RC or um, maybe one of your local brands from a grocery store, you know, like a uh, Sam's Choice or something like that. But this has got a completely different flavor than any other cola I've ever had. It's almost not even a cola. It's almost more of a sugar cane soda. Because things tend to get sweetened with sugar cane or cane sugar. This one actually tastes like sugar cane. And it's um, really, really unique as far as that goes. So I'm going to show this to you real quick. And open such a sweet smell it's it's undescribable you just have to get one for yourself and smell it you get a hint of a cola but it's so sweet it, it's really crazy and there's your cap swamp pop cola cap all right I'm gonna show you this real quick show you what this looks like here That looks almost like a root beer, like a well-brewed root beer, the way it froths up like that. And it stays frothy like that. It, You saw it in the glass bottle. I wasn't shaking it up or anything. It keeps that froth on it. And it's, um, it's pretty unique as far as that goes. Um, there's not that many sodas out there that actually stay that way. I mean, look, look at it. I mean, it's just it's attaching all over the glass, that froth is. So let's try a little bit here and then when I'm done with the video I'm gonna have dinner and this is gonna be my soda with it. That is insanely good. One of my favorite sodas, probably my favorite cola, truthfully, even over the big brands. It's uh, it's hard to describe except it's sugar cane. Uh, there's some kind of extract in it and I'm not sure exactly what it is. Uh, I can't even really say the word. Quija? 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 I don't know. Q U I L A J A extract. It's some kind of fruit. But um, I don't know if that's what I'm tasting or if it's just a pure cane sugar. Whatever it is I'm tasting, it's very good. It's, it's insanely sweet, though. You have to get ready for a really sweet soda. Everyone that I've let try this has said the same thing. It's really good, but it's really sweet. I myself like a different sweet soda. I don't like a real syrupy soda. This one is not syrupy. And what I mean by that is you can tell when something is cheap, just cheap and syrupy. You know, maybe a, uh, maybe even a Fago or something like that, or maybe your, uh, your local grocery store home brands, you know, the ones that are, you know, 
that store's personal brand of uh, soda that you can't get anywhere else. The, the off-brand stuff. That kind of stuff, you can tell it's kind of syrupy. It, it attaches to the roof of your mouth. It stays with you after the fact. This one here doesn't do that. It's got an aftertaste, but it's a real sweet aftertaste. And it, it's, like I said, it's extremely sweet, but not syrupy. Good carbonation level. It has that bite that uh, sodas have that I like. Uh, the stronger sodas do, where you can feel it burn a little bit down the back of your throat. Not a ginger burn or a spice burn or anything like that. Just the carbonation level and the acidity in the drink itself. It actually does burn a little bit. And I like that. that that's the kind of attribute that a, a Coke has over a Pepsi. I don't get that from a Pepsi as much as I do a Coke. I get that from these. But the flavor, you can't compare this to one of the big brands. The flavor of it is so different. I highly recommend, if you like cola, this one is going to blow your mind how different this tastes and how good it tastes compared to the other ones. So go find you a Swamp Pop Noble Cane Cola and you're not going to regret it. They sell them by the bottle at World Market and they sell them by the four pack at Rouse's Supermarkets and it's worth it. So have you ever had one of these? Do you like it yourself? Let me know in the comments. Do you like the video? Follow me on Twitter at Soda underscore Hunter. Facebook.com slash Soda Hunter Kevin. Subscribe to the channel. Like the video. Comment. And until next time, thank you for watching.